Boats have been used by humans for thousands of years, dating back to prehistoric times. From simple rafts to complex ships, boats have been integral to human civilization, allowing for transportation, exploration, trade, and warfare. We will explore some of the most important ancient boats, including their history, construction, and uses. The ancient Egyptians were among the first people to develop boats, using them for transportation, fishing, hunting, and trade along the Nile River. They constructed boats from a variety of materials, including reeds, wood, and even stone. One of the most significant ancient Egyptian boats was the papyrus boat, which was made from papyrus reeds. The papyrus reeds were harvested from the Nile River and woven together into a mat. The mat was then folded and stitched at the edges to create a boat shape. The boat was then coated in resin to make it waterproof. The papyrus boat was lightweight and buoyant, making it ideal for navigating the Nile River. It could be propelled using paddles or sails made from woven reeds. The papyrus boat was used for a variety of purposes, including transportation, fishing, hunting, and trade. The ancient Egyptians even built large warships made from papyrus reeds that were used for naval warfare. The indigenous peoples of North America, South America, and Africa were also skilled boat builders. They used a variety of materials, including bark, animal skins, and wood to construct boats for transportation, fishing, and hunting. One of the most important ancient boats built by indigenous peoples was the dugout canoe. The dugout canoe was made by hollowing out a single tree trunk, usually a cedar or redwood tree. The tree trunk was split in half, and the interior was carved out using stone tools. The exterior of the canoe was then smoothed using sand and water. The dugout canoe was an important mode of transportation for indigenous peoples, allowing them to navigate rivers and lakes. It was also used for fishing and hunting. The dugout canoe was an essential tool for survival, allowing indigenous peoples to travel great distances and access resources that would otherwise be out of reach. The ancient Greeks were also skilled boat builders, constructing ships for transportation, trade, and naval warfare. One of the most significant ancient Greek ships was the Trireme, a warship with three banks of oars. The Trireme was built using a combination of wood, bronze, and iron. The hull was made of planks of wood fastened together with wooden dowels and iron nails. The oars were made of wood, and the oarlocks were made of bronze. The trireme was powered by a crew of over 200 men, who rowed the ship using the three banks of oars. The ship was propelled forward by a large sail made of linen. The trireme was essential to the naval power of ancient Greece, allowing them to dominate the Mediterranean and engage in naval warfare with other powers, such as the Persians. The ancient Chinese were also skilled boat builders, constructing a variety of ships for transportation, trade, and exploration. One of the most important ancient Chinese ships was the Junk, a large ship with multiple sails. The Junk was built using a combination of wood, bamboo, and silk. The hull was made of wooden planks fastened together with iron nails. The sails were made of woven bamboo and silk, and the rigging was made of hemp rope. The junk was propelled by a crew of over 200 men, who worked in shifts to keep the ship moving day and night. The ship was used for transportation of goods and people along the coast of China and beyond. It was also used for exploration, with Chinese sailors traveling as far as Africa and the Arabian Peninsula. The junk was an impressive feat of engineering, with its multiple sails allowing for greater speed and maneuverability than other ancient ships. The Chinese also developed advanced navigation techniques such as the use of magnetic compasses that allowed them to travel long distances with greater accuracy. Throughout history, boats have played a vital role in human civilization, enabling transportation, trade, exploration, and warfare. From the simple rafts and canoes of prehistoric times to the complex ships of the ancient world, humans have continually developed new and innovative ways to construct and use boats. The papyrus boats of ancient Egypt, the dugout canoes of indigenous peoples, the triremes of ancient Greece, and the junks of ancient China are just a few examples of the diverse and sophisticated boats that have been developed throughout history. These boats reflect the unique cultural and technological advancements of their respective societies, and their legacy can still be seen in the boats and ships of the modern world. As we continue to innovate and develop new technologies, 
it is likely that boats and ships will continue to play a critical role in human civilization, allowing us to explore the depths of the ocean, transport goods and people around the world, and engage in naval warfare.